Hey guys, our affirmation for the week. I am a beacon of love and light. I now rise and take my place. I am a beacon of love and light. I am a beacon of love and light. I am a beacon of love and light. I now rise and take my place. Probably longer and lengthier at some other point, but I wanted to share that with you because you know what? Sometimes we separate our spirituality from our actual practical life. We think it's separate, but the truth of the matter is that we're the same person. We're the same person. We're still living the one life. You can be a beacon of love and light in your family, in your workplace, in anything, anywhere, in the shop that you go visit, anywhere. <laughs> You are called to be love and light. Why? Because we live in a world that needs people who are ready to be love and light. I'm going to stand here for a bit, face the sun. Nah, not too much. <laughs> but, you know, we, the, the world needs people like you and I who are willing to stand up and be who we're born to be, okay? That's better. Who are willing to stand up and be the love and the light in the world, okay? You, you don't need to be, you don't need to have a, a, a title. You don't need to... It, I don't know, we do this separation thing, you know, we do this, oh, no, no, I don't want to talk about my spirituality when I'm at work, or I don't want to talk about my spirituality and force it on somebody else. This isn't about forcing it on anybody else. It's about recognizing that you're always the same person in whatever situation of life you find yourself in. You're always the same person. You're always a beacon of love and light. You are always someone who is aware of the fact that you're a divine being. You are always someone who is aware of the fact that you're having a human experience and that you can actually be the light for someone else who is getting caught up in the craziness of everyday life, okay? So you are a beacon of love and light. You have to choose to rise up and actually be that person every day. You can't get caught up in all the nonsense happening in your life and thinking that, oh, no, no this is separate. This is a separate part. When I, this is when I'm Christian, oh, not Christian. This is when I'm spiritual and this is when I'm not. No, we're always spiritual people. If you're going to be prosperous in your health, wealth, relationships, every area of your life, then you are going to need to be that divine being in every area of your life. So yes, the affirmation for this week is I am a beacon of love and light. I am a beacon of love and light. I am a beacon of love and light. I now rise and take my place. I feel kind of crazy standing in the middle of the road singing this. But hey, <laughs> what does it matter? I'm a beacon of love and light, right? <laughs> anyway, let's be deliberate designers of our life, you know, and be beacons. Let us be aware of who we are. Let us be aware. Because in the awareness, wherever you are on this planet, you can make a difference to somebody just by being all that you are born to be just by being all you're born to be. Sometimes people are waiting for somebody else who has a title, somebody else who has a role, but you, you, you are that beacon for someone in your life right now. So go be hope to someone in your life right now. Come on, be deliberate. Be deliberate about your life. Be deliberate about how you show up in the world. Rise up and take your place. Don't wait for someone to give you a title. You are a leader now. You are love and light now. You, right now. You, say hello. Say hello. Who are you? Who are you watching me right now? Say hello. And this is it, guys. I'm starting something. Well, I started it, but now I'm really going all out with it. It's called the opulence cycle. Circle. The opulence circle. Okay? Now, this is a, a gathering for deliberate people, people who are determined to deliberately design their life. If you've been work, watching my work, if you've been interested in what I'm up to, this is where you need to be. It starts at just $2 a week, and you can come and join in and be part of our community, our growing community. Come and be at the ground floor. I don't know when, how long that price is going to remain the same, but this is your time. I don't care where you are on the planet. You know that you are called to something more. You know that you're here to make a difference. So I invite you to go and have a look at the opulence site, a circle. It is at um, rosemarynonnynight.com forward slash opulence circle. Let me just put the link in here for you. And really it is about every area of your life, starting to be prosperous in every area of your life as you choose to do, as you choose to live a deliberate life, okay? As you choose to live a deliberate life where you're no longer passively waiting for I don't know what, someone to come and save you, where you realize that you, the God power within you, is absolutely capable. Hello, Herman, how are you doing? Is absolutely capable of 
changing your world. Herman, I mean, you need to come and join in. You need to come and join in. You specifically. <laughs> okay, I'm speaking to you, Herman. <laughs> And I'm speaking to everyone as well. Listen, if you know that you've been watching my work and you've been wondering, I've created this space where it's, it gives you time to really get into the vibe of being deliberate, okay? It's a place where, you know, we'll be, you know, it's, it's the deliberate life method. How do you deliberately design your life? And you'll easily, little by little, you know, I'm very much about immersion. Hey, Cecilia, come and join us. Um, you know, I'm very much about immersion. As you immerse yourself in a different way of acting, of being, of thinking, then life changes for you, okay? So come and join us in the circle. Come and join us in the circle. Come and be immersed in a different way. A lot of the work that I'm doing, I'm going to be taking into the circle now. I'm going to be trying to really focus in on just people who have shown willing to actually change their lives. Because it's one thing to talk about it and to wish for it. It's another thing to actually be willing to put yourself in a place where it becomes your reality. So yes, I invite you to the opulent circle. It's everything you need for your relationships, for your health, for your wealth, for your whatever, for your spirituality, for your all of it. We're going to be covering all of it. We're going to be looking at how we can deliberately design every single area of life, okay? It's rosemarylonyeye.com forward slash opulent circle. The link is just there. So go and have a look at it. And again, the affirmation for this week is I... I'm a, no, I am a beacon of love and light. I am a beacon of love and light. Can you see me do my dance? I am a beacon of love and light. I rise up and take my place. And again, I am a beacon of love and light. I feel a bit silly. I am a beacon of love and light. <laughs> I am a beacon of love and light. I rise up and take my place. So yeah, go and have a look. Rosemarylonyeye.com forward slash opulent cycle circle. It'd be absolutely amazing to have you. <laughs> Don't look back one day and think, why didn't I do it then when it was only two quid a week? <laughs> Don't be that person. Go join in right now. Much amazing love. Until the next time, my honeys. Share this with somebody else. Share this with somebody else. Let's be beautiful.